Hello everybody, all you wonderful people, and welcome back to The Walking Dead. Here we go. Let's continue on episode 5. The last episode of the season 5. Here we go. Alright. Loading screen a little... And unfortunately, in the last episode, Kenny died because of the choices I made, or we made. <coughs> Do you want to talk? Kenny was my friend. He could be tough to like, but I agreed with him most of the time. So Definitely. We're assholes together, I guess. Look, Lee, this is a shitty time, but I want to clear something up. What is it? Now with Kenny gone, it means Omid and I have to stay safe. For her. You guys would be great for her. Keep her safe. We do our best. You know that. Whatever your best is, I'll trust it. That's all you can do. That's all you can do. That's ah, looks be careful like a uh, pretty damn not good looking crossing. Something's gonna happen. I know that. Something's gonna happen. I know that. Now. Now something's gonna happen. No! Real I was wrong! Ahead. I was wrong! Nothing happened! Whoa, careful! Whoa! Even the buildings are full. Be careful through here. Yeah, we don't need any more accidents. I'm sorry. It's okay. Let's be careful. I thought that I in the bridge I was gonna fall down or something. I mean, almost fall down or something like that, but no. I was wrong. I was very, very wrong. There's just a lot of walkers everywhere. Well, at least it doesn't look like a death trap. Are you sure about that? Who's going first? You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg. And you're walking for two. I'm obviously not doing so. Decision doesn't make itself. Ah, uh, whatever. You two should go across first. You're the lightest, Omid. I'll follow right after you. Okay. Well, here goes nothing. But don't get. You know what I said about Clem. I didn't doubt it. I appreciate it. On the sign at the doing? same time. Good enough. Nothing has happened for Lee yet. He's still normal, even Rista, though he's bit. Next. I mean, he's had a few concussions and all, but nothing too serious. Shit! Oh crap. Shit. Well, I gotta find another way out. Le it looks like that. What are you gonna do? Uh, 
I'll figure something out. There's not a ton of options. Uh... Can you help me? I don't know what we can do from here. Anything. It's fucked, Lee. Fuck it. I'm going for it. Going for it? What does that mean? It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? Find a boat. Find a boat. We'll meet north of town. A boat? We still have to get out of the city. I'll get Clementine and meet you. What if... Don't what if. I'll meet you. Okay. Well, apparently we are just gonna go down to street level. Oh, they didn't, didn't give a shit about me. Well, what if I just play one of them? What do you have in mind, huh? Oh, you're going for it! Okay, this is some action! There we go, one by one! Okay, you're next! And then you! And anyone in my way. And then it's time for you. And oh crap! Well, that was not uh, intended to happen. Okay, try again. You can always try again. It's not obvious. I mean, since it's not real life. Alright. Take these guys down. Uh, just hit the next zombie available. And I should be good. Alright, so I'm like in the middle of them playing like one of them but at the same time I'm killing them so yeah oh crap that was a hard shot Lee That was some real fighting over there. I didn't even know that was possible. To just get through those herds of zombies like that. Okay. Let's look at the floor. The ceiling. Anything have any... Interesting. Listen. Well, I don't want to open it first, so let's let's listen first. Lee, what about those sharp? Uh, you know, sharp. Like you had the glass on your left hand. What about that? How did you stop the bleeding? Well, I don't know. Let's open the door. Okay, looks really 
abandoned. What is this place? Oh, wow. I got us adjoining rooms. Hello. Okay. This is Sybil. You look horrible. Who are you? Go over there. Just take the gun, Lee. Put your things down. Let me out. He's out there. There's a bottle on Quiet, the please, desk. Sweetie. Your things there. Just be cool. Do I not seem cool? Good. Go sit down. Who is this guy and what does he want? Do you know who I am? No, I don't. No. I don't know anything about you. You wouldn't. People like you don't. Now you're thinking. Oh, people like me. me huh? A few weeks back. There might have been a station wagon in the forest, full of all sorts of food, water, things you need to survive. Yeah, I'm not some cannibal either. Some killer out in the woods. Some villain. I'm just a dad. I coach little Lee. Oh, so it was for the taking. Yours. For the taking? Do you know what you took from me? I'm sorry. Whatever it is, whatever happened, you have to hear that I'm sorry. That doesn't mean anything to me. I wish it did. I'm not a bad man. I don't believe in vengeance. But I've got nothing left. Is it your like family die or hurt somebody? Or what you care about? No, that's not true. You didn't care about that woman before holding her back so your friend could bash her dad's brains in. I heard. So bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. Oh, he man. He never found him. I heard her. Then you took all of our things. You robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, Lee, but not after that. I'm sorry. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them a day later. In the road. Uh, a monster to you. No. I'm not like you. You killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. It's more complicated than that. You lied to her about who you really are. I wouldn't 
wouldn't do that again. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. You stole that from us. I fucked up. Yes, you did. I fucked up. Just give me Clementine back. I'd rather kill her myself. Because that's what will happen if she goes with you. What? After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Leave, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad now. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been to you. It's not happening. You're crazy. Keeping her with you is crazy. Let us go. No. No, I don't think so. You're going away, and we're starting a new family. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. Do you... I'm glad to. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> Oh shit. You're not gonna kill me. Oh man. Oh. Okay, slowly, slowly, but surely. You're not taking my girl away from me. Is that clear? He attacked me. Or was going to attack. Uh, I'm gonna shoot him. Just to be he would have take come back. care. That's right, sweet pea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. At okay. least we're together, Clementine. You look horrible. I know. That's what he said. Let's just get somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Clem, it's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. Okay now. 
need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Man, this girl has seen some tough things. He was going to kill you. And take you. Yeah. Stranger. Don't kidnap my girl. Okay, Clementine. Time to go. Which way out? Through there. Okay, then it's through here. Out to the hallway. All right, open the door. <gasps> oh, hello. <laughs> they don't even bite me. Crap! That must have attracted a lot of yeah. attention. I know it. Must have. You're covered in all that gross stuff. Had to get through a bunch of them to get here. Maybe that helps. That to get out of Savannah. Okay. They smell horrible, which means you have to too. Yuck. Okay. Okay. And here we go. Chop chop, Walker. Oh no. Oh man. And you have to cover yourself in all that stuff. To stay alive. You a strong girl. We'll get you cleaned up as soon as we can. Not soon enough. What do you miss by mean we'll by cleaned up as soon as we can? What do, what not you mean by I, not soon enough? Done. One more. I want to be sure. Okay. Smear Clementine. <laughs> there. That should do it. I hope so. Me too. I, of it. I thought it was gone. I thought you were gone. Thank you. Thank you. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around and don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. She has seen so much stuff that she is capable of doing that. That. But that is to see in the next episode thank you everybody for watching i hope you guys enjoyed and i'm gonna see you guys in the next episode or some other episode there's a lot of videos on my channel but i hope you enjoyed this one and see you guys later bye bye everybody